Okay, so this is a photo that shows an example of a sediment production zone. And the sediment production zone is where you have the most energy um, in the river system. And because there's the most energy, you have the most um, likely area for production of sediment by erosion. So this is always in the headwaters of a river, that is where the rivers are beginning, and it's where you have a very steep gradient. Um, for those of you that have ever kayaked, if you've heard of a steep creek, or if you've been whitewater rafting, you've seen lots of um, turbulent waters, white water out there, that's the type of environment you would find this in. So what happens is this water is churning and churning and churning and it's picking up sediment and smashing that sediment, uh, pebbles, boulders, and rocks against the bottom of the channel and against the sides of the channel. So those pieces of bedrock get smashed into smaller pieces. Those smaller pieces provide the uh, material for erosion. So the banks get eroded as well as the channel bed gets eroded. This, um, this process uh, deepens the river over time. Um, all rivers are trying to cut down to what's known as base level. And as it's cutting down and eroding down to base level, it's moving all of that sediment out of the way and taking it downstream. So this area in the headwaters of the river, in the steep area in the mountains, is the sediment production zone.